Welcome to episode two in our series on economic growth. In this episode, we're going to talk about natural resources and how they affect a country's economic growth. So first, we need to learn about what natural resources are. Natural resources are all the things found in or on the earth. They're gifts from nature. Um, all resources are limited, but some resources are more limited than others. So let's look at some different types of natural resources. So natural resources, like I said, there's something found in nature and used by people. Uh, there's two types. There's non-renewable natural resources. So they can't be replaced in our lifetime. Once they're used, they're gone. So there's a limited supply, a very limited supply of these. But then there's also renewable resources and they can be replaced and replenished and regrown in our lifetime. And they're replaced by nature. So some non-renewable resources are oil, coal, nuclear energy, and natural gas. Once we use up the supply, then we can't refill that. But then renewable resources are things like the sun, water, wind, animals. They reproduce and more animals come to life and we have that population continues. And then plants we can replant seeds and regrow crops and so those are all renewable resources so in your notes on a separate piece of paper you need to make sure that you include this graphic with your non-renewable resources and examples and your renewable resources and examples so like we talked about examples are land water sun plants time air minerals oil and different things like that and these are renewable and non-renewable why this is important to a country's economic growth is without them, the country must import all the resources they need. And so they can't produce everything they need. And it's very expensive to do that. A country is better off if it can use its own resources to supply the needs of its people. So we get to use what we have rather than having to pay and trade with other countries. And so if a country has many natural resources, it can trade or sell them with other countries, which also generates profit. So we need natural resources to make the items and the necessities for our country to have those. And then we also need them to produce revenue and make money by trading and selling them with other countries.